So we've been talking a bit about our backgrounds and experience. Uh, in the title of this, we're talking about fixed wireless broadband and Wi-Fi mesh. So let's let's do a quick definition, um, sort of a, a, a very high level architecture of fixed wireless broadband and mesh to help the listener sort of get in tune with what we're talking about. So Drew, what, how would you describe uh, fixed wireless broadband? Is there, is there sort of a, so hub spoke type technology, what, what do you think about fixed wireless broadband? Yeah, the way I think about it, I think about utilities and I always, I try and describe everything as, as a utility service. Um, when you think about a water tower and you think about the way that water tower delivers water all throughout a neighborhood, uh, that's the same thing as fixed wireless broadband in a sense. You have one central location that deploys uh, wireless access all across the board. It's like a transmitter station and you have all these different locations that can dial into it or, you know, to use an old term, but to call back into it and connect to it. Um, so fixed wireless broadband to me is either a point to point connection or a point to multi-point connection. It's a fixed location communicating from point A to B or from point A to B to C to D to E. So that's why I good. think about fixed so, wireless. Good. So you introduce, and we'll come back to that, those, those a little bit later as we talk about the network design process, but point to point, so wireless can be a bridge. We can go from uh, water tower to water tower and, and transmit high speed data point to point. And the other one you mentioned is point to multi-point where one device then connects to multiple endpoint devices. All right, so that's our, this is our fixed wireless broadband short definition. Gino, if I, yeah. if I asked you to tell me what is Wi-Fi mesh? That's something a lot of people know about. A lot of people have Wi-Fi mesh in their home perhaps, yeah. and they may have that in their mind. But when it, when it comes to the network deployment, how, how would you describe Wi-Fi mesh? Well, uh, uh, you know, uh, it's, it's a type of technology that's it's used to quickly, I would say, quickly deploy some sort of uh, last mile access to the end user. Uh, and, the end user and the end user being uh, one that has a, a Wi-Fi compatible device. So uh, you have a situation where you need to quickly deploy access to a certain area, uh, you use Wi-Fi mesh. Uh, and Wi-Fi mesh is a couple of Wi-Fi devices, it could be two or more, uh, that interconnects each other uh, through the same usually the same radio that is used to access the, the end user. Sometimes you have a second radio to take care of the inter-node connection. Uh, and that's basically uh, what I will define as, as Wi-Fi mesh. Uh, Wi-Fi mesh has some, uh, uh, and, and it has a long history. And so for some time, maybe it was even a, a bad word because uh, some sort of performance issues that you will uh, find with deploying that kind of technology. But I think that nowadays I have to evolve into a, a a good tool to have available in your in your toolbox. Excellent. So you, you gave us a really critical uh, statement in there that in with Wi-Fi mesh, generally you are using the same radio to replicate the signal for connecting between access points, hopping between access mm -hmm. points and connecting client devices using the same radio in, in most cases. And so that's so, and, and therein lies both the advantage of Wi-Fi mesh and in some cases, it's Achilles' heel, right?